Hi guys, my name is Muhammad Shahzad and you're watching my YouTube channel Skill Set with Shahzad. So as we know in our previous video we have installed Cisco Packet Tracer Network Simulator uh, from the from the Cisco Academy website Skill Set for All or Skills for All. You can go on the website and then you can download. If you don't know how to download this product, I already have a one video in my list. Uh, basic uh, networking there you can find so what is a packet tracer packet tracer is a network simulator tool used primarily for learning and practicing network concepts it allows users to create virtual network topologies and configure devices without needing physical hardware here are some basics to get you start let's go for example for our second it has a interview uh, interface overviews uh, with the workspace where you can design virtualize your network topology devices includes routers switches pcs servers and various other network devices contains tools for adding and configuring devices cables and other network components device configuration you can access any device uh, configuration through the command line interface or graphical interface let's see I'll open my packet tracer and we can see visualize uh, if it is a visualized topology there uh, we can play with I will go to my packet tracer here is my packet tracer and I will open it for you guys there is a very nice interface and this is the visual topology here you can see <coughs> as we mentioned in our slide there uh, you can design a topology include routers which is pcs so if you see here here is the routers here is the pcs which is server tv iphones and different type of towers wireless and other stuff here so we can design that one also uh, in packet tracer uh, configuring uh, adding and configuring cables we have here all stuff with the cables you can uh, automatically choose a connection you can throw cables here strike through cables and crossover cables fiber cables phone and other coaxial and uh, serials and uh, dte octa and the uh, iot custom cables and then usb cables you have all the cables here you can connect with and play with these devices <coughs> third thing is contains tool adding configuring devices cables and other networks you can access device configuration through the command line interface and like for example we if we have a one so here one router or our switch or our other device <coughs> or other our like a pc so easily if i click on the switch it will give me a physical overview everything as well as configurations uh, this device is still booting and if you go to the cli you can see here i can configure my all commands and it will show you the version of the software and the model of the uh, uh, hardware and then all similar like a real switch so you can play with that here uh, with this one okay and then uh, if we go to the next one creating a network diagram and uh, drop devices uh, I, you can create a different kind of topologies here and if I want to uh, have some uh, my different way like uh, for example I want to have some designs and some layouts so we can create our topology for example this is our switch and we can connect a crossover a straight over cable with my uh, fast ethernet zero i want to click uh, here and i want to click on one so you can have a uh, topology here like routers and the other switches we can have a gigabit and then another one we can have from here to here so this is our topology and we can play with different kind of topologies is available on the internet as well so uh, router configuration access cli by clicking on the device and uh, uh, it will give you a uh, nice if we click in the cli we are here in the in the router now i can start configuration con t do show interface status so <coughs> I can do all the commands here uh, 
question mark we have uh, these are the commands if you put the these are the commands available here so these are only basic today I'm telling you so PC configuration we have a PC configuration you can put subnet mask IP network and everything here, here we have a PC I will go here and then configuration so here you can see there is a different configurations here is a static IP address gateway and uh, automatic you can uh, select or give a uh, IP address so this is port number and PC name uh, if you want to change the PC name and uh, there is you can give oh, okay okay desktop we have here all the settings IP configuration here we can give the main interface uh, configuration if you have other interfaces it will here and then IPv6 configurations you can give here programmings if you want to add some other things attributes you will see if in the physical here okay and the desktop you close here and you can have some terminal here okay and you have a command prompt here you can ping uh, to any other your device you want to you can put the ping continuous ping and then you have a VPN wireless and then some uh, browsers here Cisco IP communicators uh, firewalls and other stuff before in the old version we don't have like that so many things but now we have uh, this PC capable with the wireless and everything so it's very uh, very very advanced uh, you can say uh, PC here in this new latest version of uh, this um, Cisco packet tracer and we can see the version is 8.2.0 this is the Cisco packet tracer uh, version so <coughs> I will close this and then we'll go again for the next thing what is the next uh, options we can see the basic commands uh, all enable configuration terminal interface IP no shutdown and everything is available in the router same like commands available in the switches and if we go here uh, there is a ping we can test our devices uh, with the with the with the switches for example in this switch we have um, enable show VLAN okay there is a first VLAN one I will give a IP address con T interface VLAN one IP address 10 192.168.0.1 255.255.255.0 no shot I will do no shot okay protocol is up if we give a same IP to our switch uh, our PC so I can ping my um, <coughs> I can easily ping my you know PC uh, 192.168.0.2 I'll give and mask is this okay no need a gateway as of now we just gonna go a simple test ping so I will go in my IP config okay here is the IP and if we want to ping to our uh, switch from here we can do test and uh, let's see if our um, ping is success yeah it's success see the ping is there so uh, we can do test pings with the, all uh, the commands here is some trace route and uh, trace route our commands in the in the PC we can check a connectivity if we then and it's a real-time uh, network show here we can see these graphics and this showing us the real-time network flow and everything here we can say easily can see this is green because it's connected and alive these are shut down maybe the uh, our uh, port numbers are shut down or our switch is not started yet that's why or and one more thing in the preferences if we ask to show me uh, the port numbers I think here in the older version we can check enable the fax uh, UCLI tabs and there is uh, some port numbers it will publish on the on the on the links as well so here we can see show hide it show wireless so advanced these are the all the all the things which you require you can turn it on some miscellaneous is and then these are the image cleanup and some more thing if you want to make a like okay this is my head office and uh, I want this and I will I will 
select the color and I want to make another my office here so this is my another draw line for the office fill in color we can choose and uh, we can create here with the different uh, branches and we can put our you know uh, the um, stuff there to bring it inside and so we can make it like this is our office one office two you can put it here okay so on the other side there is a physical view of the uh, of the your city it's a home city you collect my corporate office and my main main data center see we have uh, mounted one pc one switch and one other and you have a nice rack layout here see this is a nice rack layout this is the physical view of the your data center and this is the logical view of your data center so hopefully guys you like my video and you know the functionality of the basics packet tracer and uh, this was the overview we walked through to the basics of the packet tracer so if you like my video please click on the subscription button and hit the bell icon for the upcoming videos if you have any suggestions regarding you want to uh, learn any um, lab or anything uh, you want me to create uh, your suggestions will be uh, appreciated and uh, i will try to make that video as well for you guys take care bye bye